So now let's learn about crops. What are crops? When we grow same type of plants in a particular area during a particular time, which gives us food and other useful things, they are called as crops. So we can divide crops into three groups based on the usage. Food crops like wheat, fiber crops like cotton, oil producing crops like sunflower. We also have one another way of classifying crops which we saw earlier. Do you remember? Yes, we can classify crops according to season in which they are grown, like summer crops. These are also called as kharif crops like rice, bajra, jawar and maize. Winter crops. These are also called as rabi crops like wheat, gram, mustard, barley. Tea and coffee grow only on hilly areas where water is not collected due to slops, such as in Assam and the Nilkiris. And you know the fields are in form of stairs. Why? For climbing on them? No, just because soil does not get washed away with water. But do you think the crops are easy to grow? No, a lot of effort by our farmers and a lot of resources are required to grow a good crop. Firstly, we need to prepare a good soil. This is done by adding fertilizer, organic matter or manure into the soil. Fertilizers are of two types. Organic, obtained from cow dung or dead organisms. Chemical, made in factories like urea, nitrates, phosphates, etc. Then we need to sow very good quality seed if we want good quality crop. As you have heard, what you sow, so shall you reap. We need to water the field at right time and in right amount for the plants to grow properly. This is called as irrigation. And to protect the crop from insects and pests after it is ready, insecticides are often sprayed. They should be used only if necessary as they are harmful. So you must have seen how much is to be done for getting a good crop. Preparing good soil, sowing good seed, adding right amount of water and spraying insecticides. Also, different plants need different types of soil. One should know what to grow at what time and also the right technique. I will tell you a very funny instance on the technique. After hearing a lot about chicken farms, Chatur decides to grow chicken, so he brought 100 chicken to begin with. A month later, he returned to the dealer for another 100 chickens because all of the first lot had died. A month later, he was back with the same dealer for 100 more chickens because second lot had also died. Dealer asked Chatur, Is there something wrong? Chatur says, Now I think I know where I am wrong. I think I am planting them too deep. <laughs> so, right technique is needed for farming, to grow any plant and even for chicken farming or else you won't get the desired result like in the case of Chatur. To protect our vegetable crops, the farmers follow many steps. They put scarecrow to drive away birds. They put fence to keep away cows, goats and other grazing animals. And if required, spray pesticides to kill insects. That's a lot of work. 
By now you must have understood why your parents, teachers and other adults always ask you not to waste food. So much of time and combined effort of so many people including the nature is required in growing the plants before the food is served in your plate. Even a single grain of rice requires many months to grow. So we should not waste our food in any manner. Love food and hate waste.